The House of Representatives Committee on Navy says it is ready to support more funding uh, for the Nigerian Navy to improve on its activities. Chairman House Committee on Navy Honorable Yusuf Gagdi said this during the budget presentation at the National Assembly on Monday. Manu Ehijene completes this report. It's a yearly ritual for all government agencies to defend the budget of the previous year as well as make proposals for the coming year. To this end, the Nigerian Navy appeared before the House Committee on Navy to give a general appraisal of its 2021 budget performance and a proposal for 2022. The Chief of Naval Staff bemoaned inadequate funding in the face of rising responsibility for the Navy, which he blamed on the envelope system adopted by the Ministry of Finance. The Nigerian Navy is statutorily charged with the responsibility of defending the country's territorial integrity by sea. Safeguarding her maritime resource has been mainly preoccupied with her policing roles, especially countering the threat of crude oil theft, illegal bunkering, pipeline vandalization, and piracy, including internal security breaches, and asymmetric threats in the form of insurgency and terrorism, amongst others. The Naval Boss pleaded for more funding to enable the force carry out its constitutional duty, which are protecting the territorial waters, stopping piracy, as well as bunkering, amongst others. He listed fleet renewing, capital development, fleet support, and welfare of its personnel as key areas that must be addressed first. To effectively tackle these threats in the nation's interest, the Nigerian Navy needs to budget for the acquisition of appropriate platforms, equipment, and infrastructure without ignoring personal welfare. Honorable Yusuf Gagdi assured the Navy of the support of the House of an improved budget in 2022, but he added that contractors delaying Navy projects must be brought to book. The committee observed with pessimistic views the split of projects against agreed time by some contractors, including some that span beyond three years period without the sign of completion hand over to the Navy or concrete work in progress. Henceforth, the House of Representatives and the National Assembly will not hesitate to call to order any MDAs, and in, the case, in this case, the Nigerian Navy, where it failed to checkmate the airing contractors whose stock in trade is to waste taxpayers' money by taking for granted the delivery of public goods and services within specified time frame and quality jobs. For 2022 budget, the Navy proposed over 200 billion naira. Out of this, 25 billion was released and for fleet renewal, 8.5 billion naira approved. Concept and organization, 4.3 billion naira. Capacity development, 2.8 billion naira. Fleet support, 2.2 billion naira. Operations and logistics, 500 million naira. And welfare, 7.2 billion naira. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.